sleep banishing solution because if you can see I have a pimple right there so I'm just going to show you guys how it works it's very similar to the Mario Batiscu drying solution but I like this one much better it's a lot easier on my skin so it looks like this comes in a nice large package hand for reference and it's one of those things where you don't shake it you want it to be like centered at the bottom like this let me read exactly what it says Solution Anti-Imperfections. How to use. Okay, Clarify and Calm Banishing Solution. How to use. Dip, don't shake. Place a cotton swap into the, sedi the sediment and dot onto affected areas. So I'll just show you guys because I'm actually going to put it on. So if you've never used anything like this, I like you don't, um, don't shake it up. It's going to be separated like this with the liquid at the top. And you just take your little Q-tip, dip it down there. And then I'm going to take it and Sorry, I can't really see, but I know my pimple's over there somewhere. Oh. But yeah, so I'm just going to dot it on there. And it's amazing for overnight drying. Like, that's what I use this for on anything that looks like it's going to form a whitehead or anything like that. It just needs to be dried out because I have really combination skin. Oh, I also didn't think it's where to put this. Oops. I have really combination skin, so some areas will get more oily and some areas will get more dry as it happens with combination skin. And it's really nice to be able to spot treat in a way that's like it would it would be it's almost like a drying mask. Like you know when you do the mask and it um gets really cakey and you have to like scrape it off and wash it off with warm water. You can like see all your pores through it and stuff. That's essentially what this is. But it's amazing and it really, really works. And I love it, especially in like mask season like we are in right now. Because I just wear it every day. And every night I just put it on under my mask. And no big deal. And even right now if I were doing this live, if I didn't tell you that was there, I just wouldn't turn. And so you never see it. But it's usually 21 bucks, which is like not a lot for an acne treatment. Especially because you see how little you put. Like, And I did it semi-irresponsibly where I have a lot left over on this. You could just barely dip it in the top and not be wasteful at all but there's so much in there like the area that's settled is like three-fourths of or probably two-thirds of the jar and so it lasts you a really really long time as opposed to like a cream or an ointment which comes in a smaller um tube or whatever and then you apply it like so so anyway i love this it's a lifesaver everybody knows that the mario Batiscu one it's that one's like a cult classic but i like the um ingredients of indie lee much better I really like the brand Indie Lee, and I feel like it lasts longer because the Mario one is a smaller package, and it just doesn't... I feel like it has cult status without really deserving cult status, whereas with this one, I really, really always see the difference. Like, I really trust this product. Like I said, $21 normally during my life, and in the 15 minutes immediately following, it is $17.85, which is very normal for an acne product and really such a steal because it's so worth it, and if it keeps you from having... A pimple like I always put it on it if I start especially on like my jawline area I'll sometimes get like a big pimple like one or two at a time and if I can catch it coming and start with this it really really shortens the lifespan of it also I'm being a little more quiet and reserved today because we do have guests in the living room so sorry if it seems extra boring but it is what it is I'm also no iced coffee for me today just water All right, so, okay, let's move on. Anyway, Indie Lee is great, and since my thing is Get Ready With Me Beauty, I thought that instead of doing just makeup, because I also have all of my makeup, and a lot of it is sold on Bear Shop, but I don't want to over-order things that I have, so I started ordering things that I think are just as important for beauty, but are not, it's not like the stereotypical, like, and here's my blush, and here's my foundation, or whatever. It's all the things that I think are unsung heroes of beauty, like a great acne drying out, like a, some, a product that dries out pimples, amazing unsung beauty hero product because you need it. And it works so fast, which is one of the things I love about it. All right, let's go to, oh, what is this? 